I definitely was the kid who was overly nervous for like my high school speeches that were like two minutes long and you know, I definitely hated being in front of crowds. I want him to succeed to the level that he wants to succeed to. We'll get there. There's just countless times where people have been like, man, I saw that video you did. It's definitely inspired a lot of people, I can tell. Everything's been really good. It's just been way, way more busy than I've ever been in my life. Since the last EDC, I've played about 150 shows. We're here at the Palladium. And we're gonna it's have the, the best, best show party. ever tonight. We just got to go check out the stage earlier, and it's the craziest stage. I heard that we were playing the shows, and I've almost been trying to not go there <laughs> until like until we get on stage, even just because I know. I've done that once or twice at venues where I don't see the crowd until I walk up on stage, and it's always like just an amazing view, an amazing experience. Just the fact that we booked one show to play there was amazing for us. We sold the first one out in 14 minutes, and when we saw that, like I called Derek and I was like, "Dude, we should do a second show." <laughs> so you know, now we have two nights back to back. It's definitely gonna be in terms of like production and like lighting and like visuals, like way better than any of the other shows we've done together. So I'm really, definitely really excited for that. I think the, the pinnacle or the, the moment where I kind of realized like I was just at the next step, I guess, in, in my career was at EDC this year, especially because contrasting with last year, you know, I was playing the first set. This year I played 11.30 to 12.30 on like one of the biggest stages and yeah, it was just insane. Recently, I've just been focusing on collaborations. Well, I've done one with Dylan Francis, Lux Pavilion. You know, me and the Slander guys have worked on a, uh, a few more things together. When Tyler confirmed that he was going to do his Flash Adamas collab, that's when I felt, you know, okay, people are about to, like, really find out about our secret, basically. Like, you know, Tyler was kind of like, you know, our boy, and we've been trying to push him so hard, and for them to recognize him, it was just like, wow, like, people are finally gonna know. Like, we're doing these two LA shows. We just did EDC, which is in Las Vegas. And we both have, it's called, like, the Vibrations Tour. And it's gonna be 36 dates. So it's been cool to be able to communicate with those types of kids who are where I was, you know, kind of like, share a little bit of inspiration and kind of motivate them to, to keep going. It's just really rewarding to see that the beliefs that Derek and I shared are now the same beliefs that everyone else is having about Tyler. Just to see like where his career is taking off now and how fast everything has come to him, it's just a really rewarding experience to be a part of it. Yeah.